In this video tutorial, you will learn how to create a MPC4 application having a membership database and we'll show you how to deploy it on IIS and host it on your machine. So let's create a new project. Click on new project here and select MPC4 web application here and hit OK. And in the template, I'll select internet application as it is a regular template for creating MPC4 applications and then hit OK here. It will create a new MPC4 application and now you can see we have our MPC4 application. You just need to open web config file and you can see here our default connection is string. If you want to create the membership database directly in the SQL server not on the local folder inside app data then you just need to modify here add your data source name as I am my data source name is itorian hyphen pc and our initial catalog means our database name over here so I will prefer to create uh, our database by name mpc uh, demo erase rest all part here And it would be great if you add trusted connection equals CS here and leave all the setting by default. Now run the application and try to create a new user account. It will directly create the database uh, membership database in SQL server. And now you can see the project is running on the screen. Try to register here. Click on register. And now there is a register registration page. Here if you open the SQL server and refresh your database list here, expand the database, you will see there is a new database MPC demo that we just have set up in, in the configuration file over here MPC demo. Now create a new user account here, abhim new and password and hit register. It will create an account and also you can see here uh, we have success to log in the account. Now again uh, come here and expand the MPC demo database here table and try to select the top 1000 records as we have only a single record here. You can see there is a user by name Abhimanyu. Now I am going to deploy this application on my IIS 8. To publish this web application on local IIS, click on MPC application here and then on publish. In the drop down select new here and type any any uh, profile name that you wish uh, like uh, demo MPC app and hit ok. In this screen uh, I will select publish method to file system and target location will be inside ww root i'll create a new directory demo mvc and select this directory and click on open and again click next here and configuration mode will be release mode click next and then publish and you can see here over here our application is just publishing okay and it's success to publish the application now open the IIS and refresh here you will see there is a folder uh, demo MVC right click over this folder and convert this to our application and in this dialog click on OK now try to browse this application and again login and here you can see login failed for the user IIS app pool default app pool. To fix this error, open IIS and in the app pool, select default app pool and advanced setting. In the identity, just make it network services and hit OK, OK two times. Again switch to browser and try to refresh this page. Now again a new error, login failed for user anti-authority network services.
I'm just going to copy this username in the clipboard and open the SQL Server Management Studio. Select your database and expand its security folder and user. You need to add a new user here. For this right click and select new user and type a username NT authority and login name same and default schema select default schema over here browse and db owner will be our schema okay okay and hit okay again right click on the user that we just have added and navigate to property and in the membership select here db owner and hit ok now switch to browser page and try refreshing and now you can see our application is running as we have already created a account by name username abhimanyu try to log in using that username and you can see we success to log in using abhimanyu so that's all about the uh, mvc4 application hosting on local iis i hope you enjoyed this video thank you very much